Hello everyone. Happy Wednesday once again. It is Connor here. I hope you're all having a great evening so far. Before we get started, I do want to apologize for the lighting. If you don't like um, videos with darker lighting, I do apologize. Um, it's about seven o'clock here, which is kind of when the sun starts to go down. But um, this candle actually does better. I feel like you can see the label better when it's dark. So um, yeah, this is the lighting we are going with today. A very calming, relaxing vibe. <laughs> but um, yeah, so we are doing one more candle review this evening and we are going to be talking about Kringle Candles Chocolate Bunnies from their most recent Easter collection. If you didn't know, they did release three three wick candles in the 100% soy. I love these painted jars. They're honestly so cute. Oh my goodness. These are so amazing for Easter. I did purchase all three of them, so I am going to be reviewing them over the next couple of weeks. I've got this one, and then I think next week I'll do the other two. But yeah, we're starting off with the Chocolate Bunnies one here. Unfortunately, this one is sold out. Actually, only one of them is currently still available, which is the Jelly Beans one. So if you want to get your hands on that one, I would act fast. But this is currently sold out. Normally, when a candle sells out, I will still review it if it is relatively new because a lot of the time they will bring it back the next year or if you got it and um, you got it in time before it sold out then you may want a little preview to what your um, performance is going to be like and I also just like to review for my own sake um, so that I can look back and go um, you know look at different per performance over the years and if I need to repurchase then I'll look back so it's also kind of for me as well so yeah let's go ahead and talk about chocolate bunnies before I get into the notes and all of that I am a Kringle candle ambassador and you can use my code Connor 15 to get yourself 15% off of your order definitely use that to your advantage um, but yeah let's go ahead and get started so this one the notes are chocolate cream caramel vanilla and coconut okay so Kringle does a lot of chocolate scents. They've done a lot of them recently. They had a triple chocolate in the reserve line, a sinful in the reserve line, a hazelnut truffle in the reserve line. They've done a lot of reserve line chocolate scents. And then they also had a few others. I know that a lot of people really like their, I think it's called chocolate layer cake maybe or something. I can't remember what it's called, but it's like a chocolate candle. Hold on, give me one second. Cause I'm literally, I'm on the Kringle website right now. I'm, I want to see because I've had people in my comments like wondered if I've picked this one up, but I have not. Hold on one second. Uh, lava cake. That is what it's called. Lava cake. Okay. I have not tried that yet, but I may have to pick that up at some point. Um, obviously it's a chocolate scent, but hmm, I'm interested. But as I was saying, Kringle does a ton of chocolate scents, and I honestly think that this one is my favorite so far because this is just such a delicious chocolate scent. I don't feel like it is just chocolate. And as you could tell by the notes, this is like a really delicious scent. So obviously I get the chocolate. To me, this is more of a milk chocolate scent compared to like a dark chocolate or a more bitter chocolate. This is a very sweet chocolate. It also has a very creaminess to it. Like, it's very creamy, almost to me, like borderline hot chocolate because it kind of like has that like creamy milkiness to it. Um, this scent kind of reminds me of like a chocolate cream puff because um, I definitely get the chocolate, but then I get the cream filling. I definitely get some caramel in here as well, which obviously adds into that sweetness. Um, the coconut, I really don't pick up the coconut, but you know, it's probably thrown in there somehow. And then obviously the vanilla works in well with that cream. This is a delicious scent, you guys. If you guys want a scent that smells like a chocolate, like, um, cream puff, or even like, I know I compared it to a, um, Boston cream donut. It doesn't really have that donut pastry scent to it, but you know what I mean? Like it has like the chocolate and the cream filling, 
A little bit of caramel drizzled on top. This is a very yummy scent. It's perfect for Easter if you're looking for like a chocolate egg type of scent. It's just that like really sweet chocolate, milk chocolate type of scent. I really like this one. And I definitely think that this is one that I would repurchase. Again, can we just talk about how beautiful this label is? I just love the label. So cute. The bunnies, the baskets, all of it. Stunning. So cute. So yeah, that is my thoughts on the scent. There is the K. I like to have the K pointed in the front. Okay. So that's my thoughts on the scent. Let's go ahead and talk about performance. Um, you guys know I love these three wick 100% soy candles from Kringle. They are just a joy to burn. Let me go ahead and give you guys an overhead view there. Oh, isn't she so beautiful? That stunning burn. Now I am about at the halfway point with this one a little bit less um, thin. But yeah, it is just really burning beautifully. I have got no discoloration, no soot. Like this is truly my favorite formulation from Kringle because it has that same, um, you know, 100% soy formulation that's in the tumblers, but it has that extra wick, which gives it some more strength and throw, which we'll talk about strength and throw in a minute. But yeah, the burn is amazing on this. It's the same wicks that are used in the tumblers, so you don't even have to trim them. I do trim them sometimes when they get really big, but like they really, it's just a beautiful burn. The wax is amazing. There's definitely, you know, nothing wrong with this candle at all. It is just a really beautiful burn. Um, I used to say that these are like the Bath and Body Works candles that I've always wanted. I will say Bath and Body Works has been doing very good lately in my opinion, but like truly I do feel like these candles give Bath and Body Works a run for their money just because they are such good quality scents and um, burns. Do I think that, uh, or sorry, I wasn't going to say do I think that. I was going to say they are a little bit more pricey, but I do think that it's worth the money for me personally because I'm able to finish these all the way down, down to the bottom and I feel like they can compare just as well for strength and throw as the Bath and Body Works 3 wicks do. So I just love this formulation. I love the burn. I don't have to worry about these. I will say the one thing is since it is a third wick in here, you can't burn this one as long as the tumblers. For the tumblers, I can burn them for like six, seven hours sometimes. But for these three wicks, I probably would put it at a cap of like three to four hours just because it's a three wick, so it can pull out very quickly. I mean, this thing, I just lit it up 10 minutes ago and it's already pretty much pulled out all the way. So, you know, they pull out very quickly. It is a third, it is a three wick, so it burns quickly. So just be careful with how long you're burning it, especially when you get to the bottom, you don't want your wick clips to move or anything. But yeah, I am super impressed with the burn of this one. Now on to the strength and throw. This one is very impressive for the strength and throw as well. I'm getting a really good solid like eight, eight and a half to a nine. Um, like I can smell it right now. I mean, I remember it was a couple of days ago. I was, I had this going in the kitchen and I walked up the stairs and the whole house smelled like chocolate. Like this one truly does smell like a house filler to me and it does its job at filling up your home. I have had my both my dad and my sister walk in and go, why are you making chocolate chip cookies? Like, give me some now. And um, it truly smells like you're baking a chocolate cake or like a sweet chocolate dessert. It's authentic to that. It has an amazing strength of throw and I'm just having really good performance with this one. So very, very happy customer here. But let me know your thoughts if you guys got to pick this one up and let me know how the burn is doing for you. Do you enjoy this scent? Let me know down below in the comments. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Subscribe if you're new here and I will be back tomorrow for another video. See you guys then. Bye.